Kamala Harris shatters fundraising records as support surges for presidential bid. Vice President Kamala Harris is proving that it pays to be in her position this week, as she has achieved remarkable success in fundraising for her presidential campaign. Within 24 hours of President Joe Biden dropping out of the race, Harris raised a record-breaking $81 million in donations. The momentum continued as nearly 100,000 black men and women contributed over $2 million within 48 hours of her announcing her bid for the presidency. On Monday, journalist and Black Star Network founder Roland Martin co-hosted a Black Men for Harris Call, which turned out to be a huge success. The four-hour event raised an impressive $1.3 million for Harris's campaign. Over 50,000 people, including influential figures like John Legend, Don Lemon, Hill Harper, Don Cheadle, and Coy Booker, joined the live stream. The event had a lively atmosphere, with some participants likening it to a frat meeting, as black fraternities were well represented throughout the evening. Several guests on the call, such as Senator Raphael Warnock and Governor Wes Moore, shared personal stories about their connections with Harris. CNN contributor Bakery Sellers became emotional as he recalled how Harris supported him during his darkest moment when his daughter faced a serious health condition. He passionately called for support and protection for Harris, emphasizing the importance of standing with her as she had stood with them. In addition to the support from black men, over 44,000 black women joined a Zoom call on Sunday, raising $1.5 million for Harris's campaign. Notable figures such as Jennifer Lewis, Bevy Smith, and Yvette Nicole Brown participated in the call. It has been reported that white women are also planning to show their support for Harris with a conference call of their own. Shannon Watts, the founder of Moms Demand, tweeted about organizing a white women conference call, and Maria Shriver has already expressed her commitment to participate in the event, scheduled for Thursday. While superstar Beyoncé has yet to officially endorse Harris, she is showing her support through her music. Harris has been granted permission to use Beyoncé's empowering song Freedom on the campaign trail. The song has already made an impact, as Harris walked out to it during a campaign stop in Delaware and again in Wisconsin. As the nation awaits President Biden's address on Wednesday, where he will further explain his decision to leave the race and endorse his vice president, Harris continues to gain momentum and support in her bid for the presidency. With her record-breaking fundraising efforts and the backing of influential figures across various communities, Harris is cementing her position as a formidable candidate in the race.